So I was going to go ahead and let you know right quick. Uh, I may have mentioned it. I'm pretty sure I have. But to let you know, yes, I have reopened my uh, Twitter. Got it fully updated, if you can't tell. my fr It's my side life real name, front butt. So um, I would go ahead and start this off, the actual video part now. Since we got all the uh, links out of the way, which um, I would like to address something that came about, um, which I thought was funny. And I'm going to show you something that I purchased, ironically, before I seen something like this. Because this is what I bought to uh, kind of, well, to give back. Not to the community, to those dickheads on the road that I do not like. So basically, uh, what I'm going to show you is road rage. And what my answer is to it. Now, if you don't live in the South, uh, well, maybe your friends still do it. A lot of people in the South, when I was growing up, had these. Now, if you don't know what this is, this is not a toy, but it's my toy. It's going to be my toy. This is a speaker. And what does it go to? If you guessed this, you were right. It is my way of being an asshole. So basically, you got, I got to hook all this shit up. Um, it's going to go into my SUV, run out the front. This is going to be in, you know, in my uh, cab. And essentially, all it's for is uh, yelling at people. Quite literally, it's for the, the jackasses that want to cut me off and I don't feel like honking my horn. I can actually yell at them. So that's the whole point of that. And uh, also probably to mess with people in the parking lot at uh, my work. But that being said, this is who I'm going to be talking about. And I will have him linked below if you'd like to keep updated. This man is named Jeff. Jeff decided to do this. Now, what led to this? Now, Jeff is a farmer. He doesn't do much, if you notice. He's just mainly a farmer. This is what got him right here. Uh, just FYI, he does explain this is not... Is and the reason why I'm cutting the audio, I'm having issues with the audio uh, coming through. This is messing up where you can't hear me. But basically, this is him getting tickets. I assume probably a summons at some point. But the funny part about it is, a lot of people are complaining that Karen's not, you know, getting a ticket either. But I assume somebody's going to try to fund this and uh, help this guy out. But this is the part that gets you right here. And this is why I bought what I bought. You notice, flipping him off when he's not doing anything. He's just in a, you know, a little small town, I guess, back road, just driving. And she's being pissed in her overpriced uh, tampon. Now, I'm going to give her the nickname, uh, since I love the term front butt, which is also my Twitter, if you, you uh, didn't watch the beginning. Definitely go uh, check me out. It's my side life. Real name, front butt. But we're going to call her a front butt poot. Which, if you don't know what that is, is a queef. So she's just a walking queef. Now. At this point, it just pauses, but what he does is accidentally activates what basically shoots all that nice, good, delicious smelling poo all over her face. It's all over vehicle, and that's where we get this picture from. Right here. It's nice. It's decadent. It's like good, nice masterpiece of art that shows that uh, don't mess with a farmer when he's got a literal load of poop. A lot of people were saying that it was his wife. Now he will explain over, I think, this video that it's not his wife. It's literally a Karen who got poo all over her car. Now, if this comes out as fake, I just think it'd be like horrible because it seems like we have a lot of fake content coming out these days. But this is something that uh, it was sent to me. I watched it over and over because I found it funny. But I will have him link below if anybody wants to keep up with this. I definitely feel like keeping up with this, so I thought it'd be funny. Let me go ahead and tell everybody, I hope uh, everybody starts going to my Twitter. I will be doing a lot more updates on there, along with the whole thing about trying to do at least some small streaming on Sundays or something. Um, I'm on the fence. If I can get it started, I don't know if I'm doing the Batman Arkham series by just starting Batman first, uh, or if I'm going to just play Castlevania Sith of the Night, but it's definitely going to be a... I don't know, kind of see what uh, see how it goes, how I feel. And uh, kind of go with the wind on that one. So that's, uh, that's all I got to say about this. Y'all have a good one.